I'm an aerospace engineer and I work in the high speed systems division in the aerospace systems directorate. I do structures for high speed systems, so future vehicles that fly faster than Mach 5. The Blackbird, the SR-71, was a Mach 3 plus aircraft, so we're talking faster than that. And that's really exciting. Um, things like the X-51, which is the most recent a uh, demonstrator of hypersonic capability, at least air-breathing hypersonic capability, that was Mach 5. So that's some of the things that we're working on and really pushing the cutting edge. That's the fun part of my job is that it's not just, you know, airplane structures, it's airplane structures at speed. When I was a sophomore in college, I actually applied for the SMART scholarship program. Um, I was accepted and for two years the DOD paid for my school and in exchange I had a one-to-one -one commitment so I had to work for the DOD wherever they assigned me for two years after I graduated with my bachelor's. Now I got really lucky in that, well I guess I feel like I got lucky because I got placed in a job that I love and I've been there ever since so I've been there for six years and you know I've never, I've never looked back. I get to work with some of the best people in the country in my field and that's really exciting that I get to have access and to, to learn from, from these really true experts and they're willing to help me. And I kind of feel like you only get that, you only get that, you know, care for the person and their career as they grow from the government because in industry you don't, you know, they want to see a product at the end of the day whereas from the Air Force I feel like you actually get somebody who cares about growing your career and growing you as an engineer to the greatest of your potential.